There you go. Uh, um, I'm gonna guess I have to go around for this. That's just a wild guess. Wait, wait, don't go too far. You still have to find... Oh, wow, you cunt. So... Well, there's no possible way for me to get a key here. I'm totally blicking out on what I have to do. I'm gonna obviously make this into a two and or three part video. Cunt. I'm gonna see if you can find a key in here, so... We. I'm not gonna cut this because it just takes two seconds to get into the house. Um, I gotta find a key somewhere, and the best guess is in this house. Listen, are there more of those bugs outside? Oh, maybe I should have just laid low for a while. You should give me a fucking key. That's what you should do. I don't know where to get this fucking key. Hey, how you shut the hell up? Thank you very much. There's no keys in here. So I'm gonna leave the hell. I'm gonna leave this place. There we go. And there's no keys around out here. So how in the living hell am I gonna be able to, uh. get into that gate. I have no idea. This is really annoying me though. I guess I'll be back. Yet again. Guess what I just realized? You can dig under this bitch. Wow, I'm stupid. I just didn't have a bad week, I guess. Just everything about this week's been bad. So my mind's not in the right place. Yay, that's great for a let's player not really that actually extremely sucks for a let's player <sighs> but anyway let's go through here let's just keep on running that music's really annoying that's actually like it looks like a freaking sounds like a synthesizer having a seizure or something that's probably what they did too. Okay. So do this. Where you go? Where you go? Okay, we get those. Hey, get back here. Thank you. Now there is one over here, right? Ah, crack. Crack. Chalk. I'm pretty sure there's no other way to get through this than. Did I just instantly kill me? Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, I knew it. I don't think we're gonna get through this too easily, so what now? You're gonna have to make me jump, that's what's not. Hey, 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 hey. Make me jump. Jump. Yeah, that's why you're gonna have to make it. Oh my god, this stupid bitch. I know what we're supposed to do, but you're not doing it. Watch. What? Well, I'm not gonna be able to do that. So let's die another time. Oh, why is this game not functioning how it should be? I know the game's not dirty. And if it was, it wouldn't even matter. It would still have the same freaking. Oh, whatever. Bottom line, it's not doing what it's supposed to. Cause at this, oh wow, really? Last time I remember, it was over by the bridge, but whatever, or the pier, or whatever the hell. There's nothing over here, so we go up here. Jump a lie, jump a lose. If you jump with me, I'll jump with you. And there's 
two bugs here. Oh my god. That's three. That's fortunate. That just means less collecting for me. You collect these, collect those. Go over here. Jump. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Jump, 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 jump! Ugh, God, that hurts. Just trying to do that. Hey, yeah, 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 I'm gonna bite you. Oh, do I have to dig this one simultaneously? Hey, 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 thank you for dying. Oh, oh, you, oh, you cock licker. I better not be going thank you god for all chicken nuggets in the world. I like chicken nuggets. Oh, you're, you're, you're not digging up in the... And thank you. Thank you. Excuse me. Thank you for dying. Shit. And do a backflip. Do a barrel roll. In my pants. Now we go through here. I am slightly cold in my own room. Let's walk over here. Then this. Ah, uh, damn it! This happens. So let's look, get these together. Let's go that one. And there should be two more. And they kill them. And then they explode. And this happens, and you know, all the great stuff. And now let's get the last light vessel if there's no more um, intrusions. Yeah, it's not till later in the game. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna not bother with that enemy. It's not like it's an RPG where you get level ups just for killing enemies. That'd be pretty cool. But, no. As long as I was not like that. You just kill the enemies for the holiday, I guess. That's why I like RPGs. When you kill things, you get more level ups. And in like games like this, you're just like, oh yeah, I just killed an enemy, now what? Nothing? That's freaking great. Yeah, someone did help you, by the way. But are you looking for me ever since the boss? What went funny is that said there's been scary monsters and all that stuff. Now let's collect our last two light vessels. And now there's going to be a cutscene, which is going to waste more time and even more of a part two video. The vessel of light is full of tears, and light has returned to this area. Orphan's tears? Oh, I'm so evil. I'm going to drink my Dr. Pepper now. The evil drink of evil people. Ha ha ha. Ah, oh, but it was so nice in here. The twilight... What's so great about the world of light anyway? Hee hee hee, see you later. I disappear now. Okay, fix my ear. Okay. And then that happens. Okay then. Here's the second one. Because you got the light vessels. You filled up the light vessels with orphans' tears. My name is Foron. I am one of the spirits of light who dwells in the Hyrule. By the order of gods, I protect this forest. Oh, brave youth. In the land covered in twilight where people roam as spirits, you were transformed into the blue eyed beast. That was a sign. It was a sign that the powers of the Chosen One rest within you and they are awakening. Look, look at your awakened form. Yeah, he just magically gets a green tunic. The green tunic that is your garb once belonged to the ancient hero chosen by the gods. See? 
there's another reason why he's not the original Link. Once, wait, let me look. Once belonged to the ancient hero chosen by the gods. This once belonged to someone before, which was the hero of time, which was the original Link from Ocarina of Time. Which also explains why this Link is not the original Link from Ocarina of Time. Because he didn't have the tunic when he came into Orton Village. Orton Village is a new village. And, um... Plus, Link went off into a... To search for the fairy, Majora's Mask, and after Majora's Mask, he still continued, he didn't go back to Hyrule. So there's all those reasons why this is not the original Link. I just had to give my, ther my theory, because people say this is the original. He had, like, amnesia or something, but no, this is not the original Link. This power is yours. His, his is the true power that slept within you. There's, there's a generation in this game... Okay, my theory is there's a generation of links, and that uh, every time uh, one of the heroes dies or can't be a hero anymore, it's passed off to a different link, the next hero. In nearly every game, it does that. That's the story. That's my theory behind why there's so many chosen links. They could be same from the same blood. I don't know. Link could have gone screw someone, and then this is like, like grandson to the third or something. I don't know. Yeah, apparently these are the exact tunic. This is the exact tunic that. Link once wore, even though he doesn't have the golden gloves to pick up huge ass boulders, but sure, let's keep consistency out of the uh, series. Totally. Well, well, you are the chosen hero and all that, huh? So that's why you turn into the beast. What a shame. I mean, maybe you'd just rather wander as a spirit just like the rest of them. Totally unaware of what's happening for all eternity, right? Hey, so what do you want to do? You want to head to the temple? Well, isn't that convenient? I was about to head there myself. Hey, look, I want... You yeah, you know what? I'm going to stop reading this because we're running out of time yet again. For a different time. So, yeah. We are now the link that we're going to be seeing throughout the whole game. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Now, let me explain new controls. The sword is like, just like the wooden sword, you know, GameCube, press B, and then use the analog stick for directionals. And you can also aim and do this. Hold B for that. And we shake your Wii controller in a certain way. L is different for moves. And swing the nubchuck for a spin attack. But now, we have a shield. If you do an L target, he covers with it. That's pretty much it. Then you get... It's like playing the original Zelda. You you can cover with it using L, then you can swing. But when you swing, you, can, you have a chance to get hit. But yeah, when you're just standing still, you can block. Just like that. And later in the game, you get some skills with it, too. So yeah. And you get a different shield, which is probably... A shield that everyone knows by this point. Alright, by the way, while you're running, you can hold your sword and do like a power attack. Or well, while you're running, you could be like this and then go into a stance and then immediately do the uh, spin attack. You can run while doing the sword, swinging the sword as well. So there's the controls for now. You got all the items that you had before. There's no waste just because you turn into a wolf. And that's about it. So I think this was progressive two-part video. We... We... Oh, uh, man, what did we do? <laughs> we got the light vessels. We talked to a guy. We had a whole backstory. And we turned back into a human and got new clothes. And now are able to use a shield. So today was progressive. So, till next time, Nintendo Star Power, signing out.